going to start this series here um, real quick without any fluff or extra introduction. Um, I have no makeup on. It is the it is around four o'clock Eastern Standard Time. It is summer. All of my children are home, so it's going to be noisy. But I wanted to introduce you all to my office and <laughs> the very sad situation that is my death pile and rampant disorganization here at home. Ha! So beware, it's awful. So behind me you can see part of my photography area. At the moment my beautiful mannequin is wearing a cashmere Talbots twin set that I have yet to photograph even though she's been wearing it for like a month. Huh. I've got two white box lights there is, sorry, it's gonna be wiggly. There is my male mannequin with some boxes leaning up against. If we look over this way, you'll see one of my, see, we had a kid crying. You see one of my bookshelves with a retail arbitrage Mickey Mouse chess set on the top and my sewing kit. I've got some plates and some Looney Tunes DVDs and my kids fire truck mechanics set, um, some Wii U games, my shoe cleaning set, and some other stuff on that other shelf, and then a basket full of little girl's shoes and some other stuff that I need to sell on eBay, along with I'm not sure what in that magazine holder. Who knows? The next shelf down, which you can't see because I've got a pile. Let's see here. Next one is some of my cleaning supplies and some coloring books and apparently my DSLR camera. It's just a little Canon Rebel um, 05, something like that. Then we've got a box full of stuff at the bottom there. But if we back out of this corner, you're going to see my awful, awful death pile. This is what this video series is going to be about. It is awful. You can't even see all of what I have that I've thrifted but not listed yet. I have some of it measured, some of it ready to go, some of it sorted into what needs to be um, cleaned, mended, anything like that. These boots here, where are those boots? Oh, these boots. Those are amazing. And I've seen comps in the 300s. I've had them for a few months. I don't know why I haven't listed them. I think I have a problem. <laughs> if I show you over this way, you see my, that's my cedar chest and some shoes. It is piled with clothing I have yet to list. Check out that free people denim white jacket. Oh boy, that's awesome. I did get the stains out of that. That was amazing. Over here. Boom. We have my printing center and part of my desk. The little table there holds my regular printer and my Dymo. Um, also some artwork from my kid. Um, a llama from Fortnite. Some more stuff. And more of my flipping death pile. Oh! My polka dot bathing suit. It's so cute. I need to clean it and list it. Stuff's still in bags. Some other stuff I do have listed, but not put away yet. Trash. Stuff I haven't cleaned up in forever. Up here on the wall, I have some of my eBay things I do have listed, like that little pair of adorable made in Japan couple of figurines and my vintage 70s hanging ashtray owl and some moriage pottery and blah 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 all sorts of fun stuff hmm. here is my desk here you can see my awful awful organization skills this is actually kind of clean for what it is some leftover pop some more figures that i need to list i mean look at this cute little Owl. He's adorable. Some more moriage pottery with um, foo dogs and gorgeous little things. More trash. A couple fossil wallets back there. 
this thing is amazing. Look at that. The um, file holder. This guy. Excuse me. I keep my plastic poly bags, self-stick, in there. And I keep my other self-stick shipping mailers in there. And they're the perfect size. They fit those perfectly. And those are, um, what are those? 10 by 13? Something like that? I don't remember. Here's a return. <laughs> it was a free people dress that actually had a pinhole that I didn't notice. Some coupons. A little more of my desk. Here is the underside. You can see the bags of jeans and men's shirts that I do have listed, bagged and inventoried and all that, but I have not taken care of. And a paper bag full of recycling. Some more shoes that I've determined are not suitable to sell because they have condition issues and eh, I'm just gonna toss them in a yard sale for like 50 cents or something like that. Really too bad, it's a Dolce Vita and the heels are all messed up. Sam Edelman, um, I don't remember what's wrong with that. I don't know. And some Nout sandals. N-A-O-T. Keep a look out for that. That's kind of a bolo brand. Ooh. This is my swimsuit mannequin. I love her. <laughs> She's very nice for swimsuits. Okay. Here we have my chair. This is my grandfather's, actually my great-grandfather's chair from his office. It's beautiful and I love using it in my office, but it kills my tailbone. So I keep this cushiony thingy on it, even though it's a big pain in the butt. I'm so sorry for the quality of the video, guys. Oof. Okay, so we're back to the photography station. It is set up for shoes right now. Um, that's my bottom. Those are adorable shoes. I have to list and photograph, list, all that stuff. Now if we go this way, past my mannequin and light box, you will see my other bookcase with Hogwarts Lego set on the top. I'm not selling that, that's just really cute and my other kids would destroy it if it were down. Those are all my kids' paperwork files in the magazine holders. Some cleaning supplies, some really cute um, needlework art that I'm keeping. On that other shelf, you can see some of my Taco Bell dogs that are adorable. I'm gonna try change out the batteries in those and sell them on eBay someday. Hello, Tango. And another magazines and stuff. That's my collection of plastic bags. I've got more of my death pile here. A couple of these things are listed. I just don't have them done yet. And then this little piece of art. I will have to find him and link him because he's awesome. It's my awesome owl. You are one crazy mother. <laughs> I love that. I'm so glad I have it hanging up. Okay, so, now, I've been watching Crazy Lamp Lady, and that's kind of why I've got some ceramics and stuff. I love her channel, too. If you have never seen her, go watch Jocelyn at Crazy Lamp Lady. I'll link her below, too. But I liked that lamp. I found it at a thrift store on 69 Cent Day. Thank you, Salvation Army. And it's cute. I like it. I'm going to sell it someday. <laughs> Down here... I've got some more shipping boxes all in disarray. I've got more shoes that I need to list. A couple of ties in there, including an Yves Saint Laurent men's tie. I've got a vintage Coach Willis Messenger. There's all of my tissue paper. Another bag of trash. More shipping stuff. More trash. Lamp po lamp shade. <laughs> And here's my big helper, Tango. Tingy. Tango. Tango. Tango, say hi. He's being. Hey. Bye. Don't say hi, Tango. See if I care. Some more of my floor. Yes, honey, I hear that you are bored. I'm going to make you do some chores. So, oh, goodness. Sorry about my hand. Huh. So this is my shameful office right now and my death pile. Um, future videos are going to feature me going through my clothing I have yet to list and um, getting it 
Checked over, steamed, washed, photographed, put away, sold, listed, hopefully. Um, hoping this will be a little bit of a, a flame to get me going on this, to be held accountable and put some stuff on YouTube for you guys. I'm so glad you're watching. Thank you very, very much. Um, yeah, I'll see more of you later. Bye. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed my video. I've put links to my Poshmark, eBay, and anything else that may be of interest to you down in the description.